today we the office bearer of the Meghalaya SSA School Association Central Body. Uh, we have met the Honorable Education Minister Sir uh, Lakman Rambui. And during the meeting we have discussed on three agendas. Agenda number one we have discussed regarding the pending salary. That is for the month of uh, February, March, the last financial year 2021-22. And for the current financial year for the month of April, May and June. Number two agenda we have discussed regarding the enhancements of salary for SSE teachers. Uh, and number three, we have discussed regarding the proposal which we have submitted today to the Honorable Education Minister, uh, suggesting the state government to put more budget provision in the state budget for Samagra Shiksha Abhiyan. So regarding the agenda number one that is pending salary, the Honorable Minister informed us that the delay to release the two-month salary, that is uh, for the last financial year, uh, February and March, is due to insufficient of fund which his department received from government of Meghalaya and from government of India. Okay, so I think you remember last time uh, on 2nd of March 2022, after our mass protest, uh, the government have called us for a discussion and for a talk. And on that meeting, he have uh, assured us that out of the 104 crores, 36 lakhs, which is the additional amount needs to be borne by the state government from the state budget, uh, Education Minister have assured us at that time that the state government will release 50%. And today he have informed us that on 26 March 2022, the government of Meghalaya have released 60 crores out of rupees 104 crores 36 lakhs. Added to that, he has informed us that on uh, last week of uh, March 2022, government of India have sent the second installment but added to this furthermore he informed us that both this amount is uh, not sufficient to pay the salary of uh, SA teachers all the 12 months which remain pending uh, two months that is February and March and regarding this issue from the association side we have submitted a representation on 12 May 2022 uh, through the education minister requesting him to send a proposal to the state government to release the balance amount of uh, the balance amount amounting rupees 44 crores 36 lakhs okay which is the balance amount of the additional fund of rupees 104 crores 36 lakhs because on 26 march 2022 they have released 60 crores the balance amount pending is 44 crores 36 lakhs furthermore the education minister informed us that if the state government release this 44 crores 36 lakhs also it will be sufficient to pay our salary for one and a half months and but from his side, he have uh, assured us that by any means he will find out ways and means to at least try to manage that the fund will be sufficient to pay the salary for two months for the last financial year that is for 21-22. When we ask him why there is a why there is a delay, okay, why there is a delay from the government of India to release the ad hoc installment and the first installment to the government of Meghalaya for the financial year 22-23, he informed us that. Uh, the government of India, the government of India, instead of releasing the ad hoc installment and the first installment, they have uh, issued one order to the state government to refund the unspent balance amount. See, this unspent balance amount is the second installment which the government of India released in, in, in the midnight of 31st March 2022. And then in that order, the government of India mentioned that the government of Meghalaya should utilize that amount within 31st March 2022. So the education minister informed us that it is next to impossible. The fund release midnight 31st March 2022 and the order government of India directed to utilize it within 31st March. So the, the, the fund which they received in 31st March 2022, they utilized it on 5th and 6th of April uh, for payment of SSE teachers salary so he, he also informed us that he have raised this issue in the uh, in the meeting in Gujarat which was held on 2nd and 3rd of June so after that meeting okay, not only Meghalaya raised this issue other states also are facing the same problem and they raised this in that uh, in that uh, conference so he informed us that on 9th of June 2022 the secretary of education government of India Srimati Anita sent a letter to the government of Meghalaya and informed the government of Meghalaya that the government of India have revoked the order 
uh, directed the state government to refund that uh, unspent that balance, unspent uh, that uh, unspent balance of financial year 2021-22. And he also assured us that once the government of India release release the fund that is the ad hoc and the first instalment for this current financial year, uh, from his side he will release our salary as per sufficient of fund. If the fund is sufficient for two months, he will release for two months, that is April and May. If it is sufficient for three months, he will release for all three months, that is April, May and June.